Mrs. Diebred 1 and Mrs. Diebred 2 are sitting outside their house in Donkey Lane, one darkly, one plumply blooming in the quick, dewy sun. The key thing I get from Under Milk Wood is certainly perhaps in the first voice, the, the, even right at the beginning, is all the language and, and the alliteration and the similes and the metaphors and all oh, that rich language. And rat-a-tats hard and sharp on Mrs. Willy-Nilly. Don't spank me, please, teacher. Whimpers his wife at his side, but every night of her married life, she has been late for school. Willy-Nilly postman. Mrs. Willy-Nilly steaming open all the letters. You spotted it too. He had a wonderful feeling for nature and people in the landscape, you know? It's there in Under Milkwood, actually, in a different way. I mean, that's what's so fascinating about that work, is that that is an iron. That village, those people, you know, where those buildings are and who probably those people are. Uh, I, I, was, I was wondering, my, my fan way? My van way. The F is sounded like a V, as in Wachken Wach. But think nothing of it. Your interpretation of the role is superb. Let's take a short break. You are all excellent, by the way, excellent. When he was talking to the actors, when he asked them to perf um, perform Under Milkwood for the first time, he only gave them one stage direction, which was, love the words, love the words. The thin night darkens. A breeze from the creased water sighs the streets close under milk waking wood. The wood whose every tree foot's cloven in the black glad sight of the hunters of lovers. Under milk wood has so many different layers to it and so many different levels. Yes, absolutely, there's the Jolly Roger double meanings and within there. But, and there is definitely lots of sexual innuendos, but it's all about villages. It's about people, he says, we're not wholly bad or good. There you are, that's where they live. Who? Die Bread and his two wives. He hasn't really got two wives. Yes, he has. It's about the characters, it's about the place. It's about bringing it all alive, showing something that we can all relate to and showing everyone that nobody's perfect. <laughs> <laughs>